When Christoph Clement put together the partnership of Ralph Evans and West Point Thoroughbreds to purchase a Pioneer of the Nile filly at last year's Keeneland September sale, he thought he was just buying a nice filly. Nobody had ever heard of a horse called Justify. Fast forward to a year later, he now trains the half-sister of our latest Triple Crown winner. I caught up with Clement at his barn here at Belmont, and we spoke about Egyptian Storm and her upcoming debut. I liked her as a yearling, and um, we decided to, to form a partnership because Mr. Evans was worried about the filly being too expensive. As it turned out, I mean, she was expensive, but she was still reasonable. And, uh, but I'm delighted, it's a great partnership. You know, I've been lucky with West Point before. So Egyptian Storm at the time, you know, she was just a beautiful yearling. Justify did not exist as such. You know, we did not race by the time we, we bought the filly in September. Mr. Evans thought she was going to be expensive. We found a partnership, delighted to join you know, with West Point. We've been lucky with the stable. And um, we just treated her all the time like a nice three years old. So we gave her plenty of time. She's in full work. I expect her to be ready to run sometime this fall, you know, in late October, November. And I'm actually pretty excited about her. I just did not want to rush her. Uh, I wanted to keep her with us and just to give, you know, just to build her steadily until basically uh, September. She was never, you know, she never came off the bridle in any of the work. We always worked on the bridle nicely. Now we're being a little bit more aggressive because we're getting closer to a race. She's a very tall, leggy filly. She's going to be a very big three years old. And the idea is to keep her sound and give her a chance to develop and to have a career. If she is uh, half as good as the brother, I would be delighted. Uh, the brother obviously uh, was a top class horse. Um, the only similarity I could tell you is she's not just that she's bay, but she's a very, you know, it's a large frame. So obviously the dam gives plenty of size to her progeny. She's very good mentally. Um, just physically, you know, being such a large frame, you cannot be too hard. You just have to go one step at a time. Um, but I mean, you know, she's. Um, I mean, she's pretty exciting to be around because she's been getting stronger all the time. Her works are getting better and she seems to be enjoying her training, so that's pretty exciting.